how do you inherit an existing business and make it become more successful? And the way that I think about that process is step one, make it more efficient. So the first thing that I always do is I go look at the fundamentals of the business and I think, where is it inefficient? And that's from a cost perspective, right? So like what software don't we need, right? Like how much are we spending on hosting? Like how can we get more efficient there? What sort of contractors or outside resources or in-house, like what are we do? Like, do we need all that? And does it affect the business? To, so you want to get the business to a better financial position from like day one. That's goal number one. Then goal number two is, what are the quick wins? What are the things that we can do to like immediately change the trajectory of this business? And typically you'll find business model issues. You'll find that there's just no process for talking to customer, existing customers or expanding the relationship there for the people that are happy. You'll find all these just kind of similar sort of things. You know, there's no motion on the marketing side. There's all this stuff that just kind of keeps coming up. And oftentimes it's like, it's the same three or four or five things that exists in every single one of these businesses that either stalls or doesn't reach that next level. So it's pulling those out, but it's really stabilizing the business, finding the quick win opportunities that are most likely or usually in the business model or in the go to market. And then it's figuring out what is the team that I need to like really make this a compelling th 